Hey, 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 everybody. It's Crystal from Beautifully Broken Crafts, Falls, and more. Real quick, let's do this intro. If you're new here, welcome. I hope you choose to stick around and become part of this beautifully chaotic family over here. Um, on this channel, I do a lot of crafts, DIYs, shopping hauls, some recipes, home tours, yada, yada. Um, if you ever hear me yelling at the names Loki or Munch, that is the family cat, one cat but he has two different names. Hooch is the dog. Peyton, or Pay is my 17-year-old daughter. Marcus, who doesn't live here anymore, but is home every so often, is my 21-year-old. And then there's me, Crystal. So that's it. Um, like I said, make sure you hit the red subscribe button, the notification bell as well, so you're notified every single time I upload a new video. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. It helps out my channel and comment below with whatever is in this video that I found that is your favorite find of the day. I'm here with another Dollar General haul because they're still running this brown dot 50% off deal they have going on in their home decor. So I took Peyton to work. Today's a Saturday. And I had my $5 off coupon from the last time I was in Dollar General with the last, the last haul I did. Yes, I'm a mess today. I did go in there like this. No makeup, don't care, hair up in a crazy bun. You should see how many brats I have in the back to hold up all these strays. It's crazy, but I don't care because I've been crafting and cleaning up and doing laundry and then all the mom stuff on a Saturday. Okay, so let's get into this. I'm sure you're dire, tired, tired of me rambling because I've done it for almost two minutes, two minutes straight now. Okay, so let's just uh, jump uh, right in. Uh, this was in my thumbnail, so I got this sign. It says, keep it simple, have faith, be grateful, spread hope, dream big, and give love. It's pretty big. This was originally $6, and I paid 3 bucks for it. I will probably redo this because the colors are not really my vibe. But let's, let's just break this down, y'all. You can't even get anything like this currently at Goodwill. Because the prices there have skyrocketed like it has everywhere else. So when I found all this stuff, the last Dollar General haul and this haul, I was not passing it up for the life of me. No, no, no. No, sir, no, ma'am. And then they had this super cute tray. I don't know if I'm going to change this or not because I really like the vibe of it. It says Home Sweet Home. It was originally $5 and I got it for $2.50. It's pretty big. You know, sometimes I like to try and measure it. It's more than 12 inches long because, you know, they say from your elbow to your middle fingertip, it's 12 inches, something like that, or your elbow to your, whatever. It's more than 12 inches. And then the sides just have the cutouts there. And then as you can see, original five paid 250 Cannot beat that. Cannot, cannot. Let's, I'm going to go, let's go. Yes, I'm in the dining room again. Got my receipt for my Fetch app. If you guys don't use Fetch, you guys need to. It's literally free money. Every time you spend money and have a receipt, you just scan it in there and they give you points for it. And then you can use those points to get gift cards to like Amazon, Applebee's, Starbucks, Walmart. The options are endless. So I will always recommend using Fetch. And if you don't have Fetch and you would like my reference code, let me know in the comments because I can give you that and you will actually get extra points. I don't know how many they're doing this month, but whenever you get a reference code from a friend, you get extra points as soon as you sign up. Okay, on to the next clearance uh, item. I'm going to have to do dishes and put these away before Peyton gets home because she's going to kill me. But I had to. There's two mugs. I got two more mugs. Well, they're so cute. And this one says, hello, beautiful. And it's pink. And it was only a dollar. And it's 18 ounces. So it's pretty, like it's stout. You know, it's short. But it's deep. And it's white on the inside. I love it. And there's the tag that says it was originally $2. And if you heard that noise, that was Mr. Loki, Loki, Munch, Smunch, whatever you want to call him, having his little hissy fit. They're calling this a soup mug. I'm not using this for soup. It's going to have coffee in it for sure. And it is microwave safe. Thank you, Jesus, because I like to heat up my coffee sometimes. Okay, the next mug, which is 17 fluid ounces. It was $1.50, originally $3. This is really cute, cat. 
and the handle is gold and his ears are gold but the little face is so cute and it's pink they had it in black all black and like all this part here was white and then a white one and all this was black but i just like the pink one best so cute there's the tag oh, there, oh, there we go this one well i kind of figured that do not put this in the microwave or dishwasher because of this it will cause a spark nobody needs that okay last thing in this bag which is also a clearance find it was originally six dollars i got it for three it's the comfort bay scatter rug i just like the colors it's like a dark gray and black and white and this is like my total this is like totally my vibe and yeah i had to get it and this was the last one they had in the clearance section so i scooped it up i don't know where i'm gonna put it exactly yet but it will get a home and for three bucks you can't beat it and it's really thick let's see next bag okay 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 i'm gonna try sticking with all the clearance stuff first and then move on to like which is fitting the fall on me because you know if it didn't that'd be a problem okay so they had these two signs and i picked them up pick, picked up both of them um they were originally three dollars i paid a buck fifty for them this one i might leave as is some funk on it says friends and gather here and the word friends is like in the middle and spelled out in cursive and it's got like a faux wood background. I thought that was super cute. And then the other one I found, which I'm not getting married ever, most likely, and, or any, I'm not even dating anyone currently. So, um, and I don't know, I don't have any friends that aren't already married or looking to get married, but this one says happily ever after. So this one is probably gonna get changed, but I just liked it and this was only $1.50, so I had to get it. Although the hot glue in here is a little janky, that's okay. I can fix that. But thought that was cute. Originally three bucks. Brown dot, buck fifty. And then last in that bag from the clearance department. I'm trying to see something. Hang on. None of that was clearance. Some of this is clearance. Okay. It are these coasters. They're marble and pink and gold. And they were originally $3. So I paid $1.50. You get four of them. And it just has my initial on it. K. For Christelle. So I'm just going to take this twine off. Because it was already fitting to come off anyways. So you guys can see it. Aren't those pretty? And for $1.50. And they're ceramic. And they have the cork on the bottom. Couldn't beat it. I would have got some for Peyton if they had a P, but they didn't have a P, so I did not. Um, another decor item. This wasn't the brown dot, but if you guys watched one of my Dollar General hauls a couple weeks ago with all the spring, like, candle holder, vase type looking things that I had gotten for 50% off, they sold a few things there, and they had this birdhouse. I don't know what I'm going to do with it because I don't really do birdhouses too, too much, with crafting or decorating but it was originally five bucks and it's 250 and it's all metal and it's big so i said forget it you need to come home with me because nobody wants you apparently and that's just mean because you're beautiful and it has a little candle holder thing it's zip tied to the side so it's not bouncing back and forth so they're just calling this a small bird cage i don't feel it's all that small i've seen smaller but for 250 couldn't beat that few more clearance items they also had like their gift sets on clearance so this first one i got here is from spa scriptions it was originally five bucks i paid 250 and it's a four piece spa day set so you get a lip mask a hydro gel under eye pad a foot treatment mask and clay face mask jar so for five bucks i thought why not because you know you buy one pack of these at Dollar Tree for $1.25. And then they had these cute ass, excuse my French, little um, lip glosses. 
on clearance for 50% off, so I just picked up two of them. The first one I have here is the watermelon flavored lip gloss. It's supposed to be like Jolly Rancher. Isn't that so cute? Like a little piece of candy. And then the other one I picked up looks like a Reese's cup, and it is Reese's peanut butter flavored lip gloss. Look at that. So cute. Now, you know I got to open with y'all. Smell them, see how they feel. These aren't by Lip Smackers. This is actually, it just says Hershey official licensed product on both of them. So, I've been to Hershey PA. You know, you, I never realized how much candy and stuff Hershey really made until I was there. They have everything. Yeah. I did it again. I always get that one. It smells like peanut butter. It looks kind of glittery-ish. Let's see, guys, see that? Let's see, let's see. I don't taste anything. It feels like Vaseline almost, which is okay. I think I'm gonna give it to Peyton now because she suffers from chap lips constantly. So there's that. And plus for Valentine's Day, she gave me a tube of Reese's lip gloss. That's a long story. So I'm gonna give her that. Okay, let's see what Mr. Jolly Rancher looks like. It's so cute. Like even once this is gone, I could put this in the rip it because this is just a sticker. Hold on. Take it right off. See. Keep it for Valentine's Day and Christmas time. Loki. Oh, that smells good. I stuck the lid in there by accident, so if you guys see that little dent there, that's why. It smells like watermelon. I love the smell of watermelon stuff. No taste. Which is okay. Feels good. Super cute. The collection I have going here is ridiculous. Am I done with clearance stuff? Yes, I am. Okay, now let's get into the rest of this and then we will be done. So, the rest of the stuff in this bag, they didn't have very much for Easter out. And the stuff that they did, I didn't feel like paying $5 for, I'm not gonna lie, or more. So I just picked up the only item I could find that was a dollar, but I thought it was super cute. It's got a boo-boo, which I might have done in, tra in transferring it from the car into the house. That's okay. It's a pink truck. It says Happy Easter on the side, and then it has the bunny butt. And then it's got carrots and eggs in it, excuse me. And this was only a dollar. This is the only Easter thing I got. I did just pick up a two-pack of Colgate toothbrushes that were only a buck, y'all. Only a buck. So if you're gonna if you need toothbrushes, stop buying them from Dollar Tree. Because I got name brand for a dollar, and you get two of them here. So I have Peyton Loves Red. I love purple. Perfect for one for each of us. Can't beat that. And then I just picked up these little snacks for Peyton and I. She likes these, and so do I occasionally. The Gardettos Original Recipe Snack Mix. You get 3.75 ounces. These were a buck a piece. You guys, I got two bags of them. Two, two bags. And these both expire in August of this year. So, like, if you're having a sandwich or whatever, these go good. Those go good. Or Peyton just takes it to work sometimes and snacks on it. Next bag. Only two things in this bag. I did pick up the two pack of jute placemats for $3. I'm just going to put these on my kitchen island where the bar soles are at. But I didn't want any colors or anything. I just wanted it like this. Or it could have had black in it, but I couldn't. Find. This was literally the only set I could find left that they had. And they're not horrible. They are a little thin, but they're just mainly for decor purposes. Or knowing her cat, when I'm sleeping, he will tear the hell out of them. And then I thought this was a really good deal. Um, it is by Bombay All Natural Eco-Friendly Bamboo. 
you get seven piece bamboo tool set for five bucks. So it even comes with a little caddy. So let's open this. And I think I have like a little project in mind for the caddy part. So you get this spoon with the hole in it, the slotted spoon, the little fork, the solid spoon, the solid spatula, and then the slotted spatula. And then you get this really cute little can canister that you put it all in. So I have this pen scorcher, scorcher I haven't used yet, and it's for wood. So I'm thinking about like getting a stencil cut out on my Cricut, filling it in with that scorch marker and using the heat tool gun to write like utensils or something here. Or I could put this over and do it on this side. I don't know. What do you guys think? I'll, I'll probably do it as a DIY, you know, like part of a DIY video though. But I thought this was a really good deal because that's less than a dollar per item. Seven items for five dollars. Can't beat that. Last bag, y'all. It's the last bag, y'all. Okay. So I did pick me up just a normal calendar for 2022. It's actually 16th month calendar. It was a dollar because the one that I get in the mail from the township or whatever, we all get one yearly. The cat puked on it. You heard me right. He puked on it. I don't talk about it. So I had to throw it away. And the one I have hanging up now is just too short because I hang it up under the wreath on that cabinet that has the pantry. Well, I call it my pantry. And this was only a dollar. And the sunsets are gorgeous. So I just pick this up and then here's what the some of the images look like in the back. If you guys can see, I don't know if that glare is too bad. There we go. Well, some places look beauteous. I'd like to be at any one of them, honestly. Well, maybe not this one with with all the um, glaciers. <laughs> and then, I'm going to save those for last. Don't take. Okay, last couple of things. Um, I did just get a to-do list with the magnet on the back to have on the fridge so we can write down grocery stuff for a dollar. So, again, cheaper than the Dollar Tree. It was a buck instead of a dollar twenty-five. And then I had seen Sherry with Twisted Gypsy share something like this on her channel recently. And it's a home finance and bill organizer. And I already have a notebook that I just write everything down in, but it's just simply a notebook. This actually, it was $3.25. I did pay full price for that, but I don't think it was bad. It has 12 pages in it. This is pretty sturdy. But then it has like in you like pockets where you can put the bills in. January, it doesn't have like the year or nothing. And um, income total, what you got to pay. February and so on and so forth. Every page is a little different. You got stripes on this one and the polka dots on this one. Stri okay, it goes back and forth. And then I like too that it has this little rubber band part to keep it sealed because once I get all my bills in here, this sucker is going to be exploding. Last but not least, and I did pay full price. Say it, don't spray it, girl. They asked for the freaking decor, not the weather. <sighs> um... I didn't think these were a bad price. They were three bucks each. I had seen Liz Fenwick. What the heck is her name, her channel name? She's like a big YouTuber though. Like she's up there with her subscribers. But I had seen her pick these up and she had done a DIY with them. She just put succulents in them. But I think she bought three. I only picked up two. But there are these really pretty glass globes that have this leather around it. And then this is leather too or pleather, or whatever you want to call it. And it has these little gold studs that are holding it all together. So I did pick up two of those because I think these are amazing. You could put succulents in them. They're calling them candle holders, though. And they're three bucks each, which I did not think was a bad deal at all. They only had three left, so the fact that I was able to even find them was a miracle all on its own because the Dollar General I had gone to 
last haul did not have these because if they did I would have snagged them up there okay y'all that's it that was actually longer than my other Dollar General haul but let me know what you guys think which one which find in this haul is your favorite make sure like I said in the beginning to hit that red subscribe button become part of the crazy family and the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video make sure to give me a thumbs up it really helps out my channel and share if you'd like and all that other goodness i will talk to you guys soon i hope you guys have an amazing day i love you all so much for taking some time out to spend with little old me Mwah.